And then later on, you went to the WWE and you got to wrestle. But when you went to the main roster, you were a manager for Bobby Lashley. What was it like working with Bobby? It was incredible. Um, I was just talking to a fan who just came by uh, and asked me, you know, what was my most memorable experience, just experience being in WWE. And I think just having that different perspective, you know, I was so used to being the wrestler and coming out and having everybody look at me, but being able to be open up to the WWE audience, but I'm, you know, kind of on the back end of what the, 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 the focus was. And I'm super grateful for that, for that experience. I think it taught me a lot, it showed me a lot. And, um, yeah, it made me just super grateful for just my time there in general. So, yeah, I really enjoyed being a manager. Unexpected on my end, but I enjoyed it a lot. I mean, with your time in WWE, you got to be a part of the Royal Rumble, WrestleMania. Dive into that. What was it like being just at WrestleMania in New Jersey with over 70 to 80,000 people? It was incredible. Uh, yeah, it, it, you know, the more and more people get packed in that arena, the less you start to see them, which is always interesting to me. But there is an energy, there's a certain energy uh, in the room when you have that many people. You can't really hear what they're saying unless they're in, like obviously in unison, but when you just have so many people shouting and screaming and crying and all these different emotions in that same building, it's like a buzz. It's like runs through your, your body. So I really enjoyed uh, wrestling in front of and being in front of and performing in front of all of those all of those fans. It's a really cool experience for sure.